All right guys, Garrett Morgan with Johnson RV today. One of our premium pre-owned products today, we're gonna to be looking at a 2007 Seneca 35 GS. This has just over 19,000 miles. It's on the 5500 chassis with the Chevy Duramax engine. So go ahead and come on with me, take a look. Right now we opened up all the storage just to really show off what the capabilities of having uh, pass-through storage on a Seneca like this. So we've got a lot of storage underneath. Coming on this side, this one does, it's gonna have a barbecue with it because this one is equipped with an outside barbecue fitting down below here. So you've got a quick disconnect for propane fitting. This one is gonna have a 16 gallon propane tank on board. Up above, you're gonna have a nice large awning. So you have an awning on this one that's gonna be powered. And then over here, you do have a slide topper. So it's gonna keep that debris and shed that water off. Really a key feature to have. And then more storage down below. You got your battery spot locator right there. This one does have the back ladder so you can get to the top of the roof to do any maintenance or cleaning you need to do. This one does have the seven way plug, hitch receiver that can tow 10,000 pounds. And then of course up top integrated in, you've got your backup camera. Coming on to the driver's side, we're gonna have your 50 amp power cord supplied there. We've got a 7,500 diesel micro quiet Cummins for a generator. So that's gonna provide you quite a bit of amperage. Um, and then over here, it's cool, Seneca does the utility center. So you've got your outside shower, your water hookups, and your sewer dump there. And then coming over here, you got your refrigerator panels, furnace panels, and then below, we've got more storage that goes to the other side. So this will be passed through. A lot of storage. So when you're bringing those outside camping chairs, when you're bringing the barbecue or all those things, um, a necessity to have the spot to store it. Go ahead and come on inside, we'll take a look. Hey guys, Garrett Morgan again, taking a look at the Seneca inside interior. Overhead, we're going to have the cab bunk. So this is going to allow you for that extra sleeping or storage, depending on what you prefer. This does have a flat screen that does pull out. So no matter where you're sitting at in the coach, you have that capability of watching movies and TV. You've got your DVD player up above there, stored nicely in the entertainment spot. Do have a fantastic vent fan on this one. Coming over to the living room, going to have your lounge set up for your chair. Dinette that does turn into a bed. As far as this being one of our premium products, this is gonna be really nice condition still. So overall carpet looks great in this coach. A lot of upper head lighting. We're gonna have your dual freezer and fridge over here separate. So a lot of space within here. So lots of space and an ice maker in this one. And then you're gonna have pantry space here with pull out drawers. Nice hardwood cabinetry. So really solid, really well built. Okay, and then we've got some lower storage here as well. So nice for pots and pans or even cooking sheets. Come on over to the kitchen side. We're going to have your convection microwave. And then down below, we're gonna have your stove top here. So you got a three burner gas stove top. And then instead of having the oven, you're gonna have a lot of extra storage. Now, cool thing about this is you got a lot of counter space for prepping. You got a double sink here, nicely laid out really big sink so you can do dishes and do a lot of food prep and then we still we're gonna have storage up above to the side here we got more for pantry storage drawers down below there coming towards the back we've got a pocket door so that's gonna give you the privacy from the bathroom and the master bedroom over here you have conveniently displayed so these are gonna be your tank levels your slide out controls your generator so everything's conveniently placed so you're not having to run to each side of the coach to figure out where those are Coming on to this side, this is a split bath. So this is where your toilet would be. So it's nice having your toilet separate. So that way somebody can be using the restroom while somebody's getting ready showering, using the sink, which is over on this side. So nice big sink and shower. This, I'm 6'2", and I'm, I've got a lot of headroom. A lot of headroom, really comfortable, a lot of arm room. Definitely very luxurious. Coming towards the back bedroom, we're gonna have a lot of closet space. So a big old closet, a lot of capabilities there. A lot of drawers for storage. You do have a bedroom TV, so that's nice when it comes to late night movies. And then you're gonna have more storage down below in the drawer. And then on this side, right above your bed, you're gonna have reading lights as well as more storage up top here. So overall, Seneca floor plan, really open. You do have seating with all the lounge up front, the dinette and the couch. So you have seat belts. So no matter where your kids are at while you're driving, they're gonna be buckled in safely. Go ahead and come on to Johnson RV. Take a look at the Seneca 2007. My name's Garrett and I'd be happy to help you.